It's the fourth week of promotional tour for HFM2. Ladies and gentlemen, you know they mad cause it cause it cause it was for um, middle school. Wow. You know, from you know, ranging from eleven years old to fifteen. And, and uh -huh. they lost their mind in there. Yeah. And my first album came out, they was like seventy years old. You know, <laughs> so it just bugs me out to this day. <laughs> First of all, nobody never came to my school. Right. For once. Right. You know, and um, to get me, unless it was truancy or something. Like right. That. But um, <laughs> yeah, so for me to get up there and, and know you have that influence, and at the same time not be too far from that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I wish I could come and say hi to everybody, but they probably won't help me. I think sometimes the business savvy kind of overshadows the talent. But, yeah. You know, th things that stick around for that long don't stick around by accident. And then I heard you went to some other classes and talked to other students that needed yeah, inspiration. Nah, so I'm like, well, if they were doing good, then where's the ones that's not doing good? Right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, she's the one that's Oh, yeah. You know, so let me go on in and speak to them. Right. It's more important, you know. Disrespectful, talking back. So he wanted to come up here and share some knowledge with you all. Put your phone up. Put it up. We can't. No. You could have been behaving and then you could have done all that downstairs. Can I take a picture? They told me to jump all in and misbehave and I just went right back to where I was when I was. You know, and they were all like, I guess, in, in detention. And, so, right. Yeah. So I'm like, damn, like that's why I used to be. It, yeah. You know, I just flashed back to, to school. Like, damn, that was like my homeroom. Because at the end of the day, the only people who are gonna even be a reflection of their parents people who push you through that, make you go to school, and then pay for you to go to school later on in life. You might not see a teacher later. So I'm letting you know, just respect yourself. You don't need to be in this room. Hopefully, when I come back around, you won't be in the same room. There's so many reasons why kids are, are, are distracted in school. Mm -hmm. You know, um, you, you can have problems at, at home. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, my father wasn't around when I was at home, so I couldn't get in trouble. Put your camera on them. So when they get a little older, when they when they 20 years old, and you're going to see the footage back and realize how you were acting and where you were sitting. Get this table right here. <laughs> <laughs> So like one of the dumbest reasons why I didn't complete high school was because the cool kids traditionally sit in the in the back of the class. Mm. And I was a cool kid right. that had to wear glasses. Mm. So I did neither. <laughs> <laughs> Not only did I did So you can't you couldn't see and you're and in I the back. And I still didn't wear the glasses though. Because a, a girl came to me um during bathroom break and she was like, You look so good in your glasses and I just broke and I never wore them again. Wow. I, I felt like she was lying. There's no way you can like these. There's no swag in these glasses. There's no swag yeah. in there. So I, I didn't I didn't finish school based off me being a cool kid and, and, and not being able to copy the work down. Mm -hmm. You know, that was the dumbest thing. And I make, I make sure I tell them that. Like, mm -hmm. I, you know, I kick myself all the time for, for living for other people. Right, You right. should be living for the people who send you to school. Mm -hmm. Everybody here trying to be cool for, they're not going to be around you when you leave school. I made me two or three friends that I've got that I went to school with or in my life now and know what I ended up amounting to be. Everybody else see it through TV. But you notice, you notice all the boys is quiet though, right? Yeah, they heard you. That's why you need Nicki Minaj. Can you know what? She made sure you shut the girls up, cause all the all the boys in there was they quiet. They paid attention. Yeah, they paid right attention, uh -huh. cause they don't they don't get somebody that look like them that even cares. Cause I wanted to be a rapper, so I would spend time and extra time in my English class, okay. literature and things like that, and I would just. 
you know, get good at it and learn how to play with words. Mm -hmm. And to the point where I would, even when I didn't go to certain classes, I would be in one of my friend's English classes. Mm -hmm. I just used that. I took what I needed from that. You know, I needed to know how to, I have to read my contract. I have to know how to count my money. You know right, what I mean? So exactly. it, you definitely need school. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I'm short. So yeah, with all that in mind, I just wanted to bring people back because I had doubters, you know, the last couple of years. So I wanted to bring people. I felt like what what better way to remind people than to bring them back and use me as my own competition. Camera phones capture everything right. the pictures You know done. they mad cause of, cause of, cause I'm hood rich. You never ever ever seen a good trick. You wanna pop?